When beauty reigns and sex sells, what does it mean to be sexy? Is it a look, style, or trend? Or is there more to it? I'm comedian Carrie Riley. You've seen me on the Today Show and Wendy Williams. I'm in search of just what that spark is. And more importantly, how can I get some for myself? Hi guys, it's Carrie. I'm here today in Tribeca and I'm hanging out with Robert Brace. He's the creator of the 28 Day Challenge and a fitness trainer on Fat Chef. And he's an English fella. Let's go meet him. Show you. Robert, how hey, are you? It's good so to nice see you. to see you. I'm bracing myself for Robert Brace. Good. My first impression with Robert was he was a tall, beautiful trainer. So tell me now, I understand that you were a, it's not ballerina. I don't mean no, to no, say that, but right, what is a right, male right. ballet? Dancer noble. So I'm a ex-ballet dancer. Can you twirl and throw me today? I can twirl and throw you if you would so desire, yes. Okay, do I have to tell you off though, like we're angry and then we'll have a backstory to our dance <laughs> yeah, today. Yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll put some passion and some fire into it. And what about this 28 day challenge? I wanna know if it happens every February and once every four years. <laughs> no, it happens once every month. Is there surgery involved? Um, not yet. I can see why so many clients wanna work with him. He's strong, he has a swagger about him. I want to know though, are you from London or? Yes, I'm from London. Is this the Queen's accent? It's, yes. There's nothing sexier than a British accent. And there's nothing not sexier than me trying to imitate it. Oh, I'm ready to get my I'll be done now. No, that's that speech impediment. That's... <laughs> I'm from Syracuse, so I'm going to teach you some Syracuse accent. You want to hear it? I have to check my Keylander. I have to check my Keylander. <laughs> So from Syracuse right now. It. It's, it's very up in the nasal cavities because it's very cold up there. And it's hard for us to open our mouths and talk. I'll do the rest of this thing and not actually. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Don't ever talk like that ever again. I heard that you can reduce my waist in like one minute. Right. How is this possible? Okay, it's all to do with posture and how you carry your body. Robert's all about your posture being upright and that's where fitness starts for him. Give me your normal everyday, Carrie's tired, she's running around catching the kids posture, right? Okay. Take your little finger, okay. put it on the top of your hip bone. I don't know where that is, I can't find it. I know where my underwear line is. Get your underwear line. Okay, that's up here. Okay. <laughs> Okay. So what you do is you take your little finger, put it at the top of your hips. Yep. Your thumb underneath your ribs, right? Okay. And then you increase the distance between your hips and your ribs. By right? sucking in, okay. And then you pull your abdomen in, that way your abs engaged, right? Okay, yes. And your waist will have thinned out by about an inch. It's, just yes. by holding proper posture. I kind of enjoy sitting like this, I have to tell you. I think I, it's more comfortable. Upright, oh, this is exhausting. I'm exhausted right now. All right, can you show me this workout? Because right. I need these abs to go down. All right, let's go get it. What is the camera for? It's part of the 28 day challenge. We do before and afters. Arms right by the side and... What? 28 day challenge. First he said we gotta warm up. That's my favorite part of a workout, just the warm up. And I kind of wish it would end there. And you just take your arms straight back and you breathe into the lungs. Breathe out. Oh, this is a good workout. Like this. Right, you like that? I thought you Yeah, I was hoping we could do this all day. Just you sleep. do actually have to take your arms back. Oh, up. sorry. Yes, there's, there's, there's okay. some movement involved. Oh my God, this has my spanks in a tangle. Because he has a dancer's background, he knows it's important to be very well stretched and have the muscles warmed up before you do the workout. And there you go, deep breath into your lungs. I feel like I'm at the doctor's office, I love it. Bend your knees and roll up through your spine. Good job. I don't know how you so, do it. So now you're ready to move. Do you handle, uh, this is still the warm up? This is still the warm up. Oh my God. His warm up was tough. You can manage four minutes a day, right? I am in. If I only have to work out four minutes, Fantastic. So, four minute workout. When I say go, okay. I want you to push as hard and as fast as you possibly can for 10 seconds. You just gotta do what I say. Every time he tells me what to do with that accent, I'm like, oh, I'm doing it. Three, two, one, go. All right, come on, get those elbows moving a little bit faster. I need top speed, top speed, top speed, Carrie, there you go. So he had me running really, really fast, but you gotta bring your knees up high, which is hard. He had me do that for 10 seconds and then rest 10 seconds. 
I love that. Everybody needs a payoff. He lets you work out for 10 seconds and then you get to hang out for 10 seconds. Elbows here. You're gonna punch as fast as you can. There you go, push. 10 seconds, fast at 10. I find him to be very encouraging. Fast at seven, six, fast at five, go four, let me hear it. Get your butt down, ah. please, get your butt down. I there feel it in my thighs. That's what you're supposed to do, get down there. So, how are you feeling? Out of breath. Out of breath? But that's only 80 seconds right. out of the four minutes. You're a little hot toddy, did I tell you that? <laughs> All jokes aside, you've really got a great energy because yes. you did such a great job today. We're gonna do some ballet. Robert made my dreams come true. He taught me how to be a ballerina. We're gonna do simple plies. Okay. Okay. Pile? Is it pile? Pila. A pila. Pile. You're gonna take your feet into first position. This is first position. This is first position. Okay. Oh, not bad. Are you saying I'm graceful? You are very graceful. Do you see the gracefulness? Do you see that? It's very graceful. Arm goes out. Okay. okay. You okay. see? Lengthen your fingers, you see a prince in the distance. I think he was surprised that when he lifted me up, I was as light as a feather and flying like a dove. And it makes me look at things differently now. When I pick something up, I go like this. I thank you for the workout, but I'm so hungry. When do okay. we eat? Let's eat. Let's go to Brooklyn. Oh, let's All go right. to Brooklyn. I let's like do it. Brooklyn. Okay. Robert was a trainer over a year ago on the Food Network show Fat Chef, and he still keeps in touch with his clients. And we even went to meet one in Brooklyn, Dimitri. On the show, he lost 82 pounds, and then when the camera stopped rolling, he still worked with him. Dimitri! What is, what is? Oh, man, Robert, what's man? up, man? Little, uh, drive by here. Come yeah, see man, you snuck up on me, bro. How you been? How you doing? Good, good, How's good. Everything? You're looking good, dude. Thanks, man. Okay, Thanks. I've got someone to introduce you I'm to. Hey, how are you? Pleasure to meet you. How's everything? Why don't you tell Carrie about some of your goals? Well, I mean, I'm in currently my last phase of my transformation, I want to okay. call it. And I really want to get down on about another 25, 30 pounds on my really? own. Really? How much have you lost, by the uh, way, up to this point? Up to this point, 110 pounds. Which is the size of a whole person. Me. Sort of. Well, listen, are we here to eat or? Now you're talking my okay, language. Good. You know what? Why don't you guys have a seat? I'll go prepare something for you guys in the kitchen. So you drop in on everybody? Are you going to be dropping in on me? I will absolutely drop After in on this. you. After this? Drive by, yeah, yeah. So if I call you up and say, I just ate, you know, five bags of chips and chocolates, how would you encourage me? I would ask you, what's going on? Men don't care about emotional eating. Robert does. He wants to know all about it. I like that. Uh, what do you find sexy? First of all, my wife. I think it's her spirit. I mean, she's just uh, a great person um, and she loves people. That's what you find sexy then? Not so much the physical, but the... Yeah, the uh, physical's part of it, but you know, that, her heart. Her really. heart. So yeah. someone's heart is yeah, yeah. sexy to yeah. you. Yeah. Dimitri! Robert, your plate. Thank you very much, the usual. Oh my, how did you know I like it grilled? What did you get? You don't I mind got, if I share it. No, go ahead. Oh. It's the, uh, what meal is oh. this, Dimitri? This is actually the dice it on our menu. It's, um... Oh! <laughs> That's good, right? <laughs> yes. That's why I come here. It has a lot of flavor and so no calories nice. at all. Robert understands that you're not going to be perfect. He puts a positive spin on everything. He wants you to succeed and he wants to get you to your goal. What I think is sexy about this, this one over here, I think you have an amazing compassion for people and where they're at. You have a dedication to your body, to your clients, that you're a loyal friend. Even though he works out with people on the show, a year later, he's still checking up on them. That says a lot about someone's character. Robert, I'm gonna take on the 20 day challenge. 19 day challenge. <laughs> After working with Robert for one day, I said, sign me up. This is gonna be Body by Robert. Body by Robert in 28. 28 days. Did I really sign up for 28 days? Oh I'm so excited. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> Robert's a very humble guy, which is very attractive. He's very down to earth. He is a normal guy who sounds like a king. That's sexy. Tell me in the comments below who you think is sexy. And don't forget to subscribe for a new episode sent right to you every week. From baby London's birth to his first words, this season's been an adventure. Tune in for reflection and a special treat from Nappy Taps. Suffer and suck a tash, Andrea Sirtash is sexy. Uncover the secrets of this prolific dating and relationship writer's beauty here. Megan hasn't let any challenge stop her yet, but can she handle CrossFit? Find out now. Hone in on burning serious calories and fat with Prevention's science-based program.
Subscribe for more health tips. Your body will thank you.